hey hey everybody and welcome back to our last weekly check-in video that we will be recording so this is for our last week of june we have our bill stickers here the few that we've paid and we have sarah marie's expense stickers that have been using and we have our cash wallet here we're going to go ahead and slide out our envelopes all right so we're going to go ahead and check in today is the 25th so we're going to be checking in from the 20th until the 25th all right so let's see we'll start with groceries for groceries it looks like we have three transactions we stopped and got pizza on monday i told y'all we don't eat out that often and here we are with like a lot of eating out this month which is crazy but did get pizza that was 16 went by walmart and picked up a few things we needed like some milk bread and a few other things and that was 20 total and then today i went by the farmer's market on my way home from dropping my son off at a sister's house and picked up some fresh fruit fresh fruits and veggies which oh my gosh they are amazing so i stopped by there so those are the drink three transactions for this week pizza was on monday all right walmart was on the 22nd all right and then the farmer's market was today the friday all right and that's it all right next up is spending we haven't spent anything from my personal spending then we have gas and we have one transaction i filled up my car and it was 18 dollars and i was at sphinx hey, hey. that was 18 and i did that on the 21st okay. all right yeah. i think james is gonna have to fill up this weekend Woo! so we're don't have that yet. All right, go take it and play. Go play. Okay. All right, so that's the only gas transaction. And then miscellaneous, nothing. All right, so those are the only transactions we have. So we have four transactions from our cash spending. We did have a few bills we paid. So we paid, the insurance came out on Monday. All right, and then I did make two car payments. If you saw my um, first budget video for July, y'all just heard that we purchased two cars. So we made two payments, I'm trying to go ahead and get those started. Go ahead and getting them paid down. So I split how much we saved up in June between both of those so one got 300 one got 303 which is fine all right so let's go ahead and flip on over and check in oh we need to lay down our no spins so we have one two three no spins one two three all right so let's count those first let's see so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten no spin days awesome 10 no spins i want to say what was our goal 15. so we have one two three four five so if i don't spend any money in the last five days we'll hit our goal if not we might get close to it like last month which is fine it's summer more things are going on getting out and about more traveling a little bit more so huh. but i already know one day james will have to fill up and i'm getting my hair done which i'm gonna have to pull probably from savings because I have not budgeted for it and it's only to get my hair done once a year so I'll probably just pull it from savings for now and then that'll be the only time I get my hair done this year unless I just get it trimmed which won't cost but a few a little bit a little bit just to get it trimmed up and no color or anything added but let's go ahead and flip over and see what our weekly check-in is going to look like so 20th to 25th 
All right, and I have filled in all of our categories over here, which is whew, amazing, you know? All right, so first up is groceries, and we had those three transactions. Pull out our calculator here. So we have 16 plus 20 plus 14. So we spent $50 this week. All right, so last week we started, or ended the week with 260 minus the 50, so we should have 210 remaining. All right, let's check. One, two, ten. Fabulous. And we may, I'm not sure, we may have a little extra left over that we'll throw towards our debt. Um, so we shall see. But that's that one. Next up, we have gas, and we had one transaction of 21. Wait, did I write down the right amount? 18. I wrote down the wrong amount here. I wrote the date again. That's what I was doing. I was about to say something's not right. All right, so that should be 18. Bam. Lord, about messed myself up. All right, so 18 is how much we spent in gas. So last week we had 144 minus our 18. So 126 is what's remaining. Okay, so somehow I missed a number. Um, cause it should so only be 87. So oh, I don't know if I messed up last week or if I messed up this week, but it is most certainly $87 is left in the account. Oh, and I still wrote it wrong. 87. Cause I have 87 here. And if I subtract the total amount minus all of our gas over here, it is 87. So I don't know what I've messed up here. Um, I see what I did. At the first week, I did, didn't actually subtract it. And it should have been 201 here, which would have made these right. That's what I messed up. I see it. I got this. We're fine because this is the right number now. So we're good. We're good. All right. Spending. Nothing. No spending again. Loving not being able to spend no money it is awesome, but I should save this up and buy something like really nice for myself, you know, but we have $29 last week. So that's what we have left steel. Awesome. All right. So 29 here. I might use whatever is left over from spending, put it into a hair category so I can save up for my once a year big hair color appointment because i don't go often nor do i ever go and really get my nails done or anything like that I'm just not my not my thing my daughter always wants to but she just pulls them off anyways miscellaneous nothing so we should still have our 50 but next week i might use the 50 to help cover my hair so it's not all savings so we have our 50. all right so there is our weekly check-in. We haven't done anything in our sinking funds um, this week. Haven't done any spending really. The only spending we've done this whole month from sinking funds is our Father's Day stuff. And that was it. So, which is fine. All right, so this will be the last check-in for the month. I will do the last week here because I have, um, what is it, five days till the end of the month. And I know I'm going to have an unbudgeted category here, a gas transaction, maybe another grocery trip, picking up a few things that we'll need somewhere in here as well. Let's see. I want to say that's going to be it. So I will definitely close out these last five days in this section here. So I know exactly how much we spent and what was remaining. Um, but that's it. That is all we have for this video. 
we have been having some short weeks not much to not much really going on um not going as many places but we are i'm going to my sister's more often as she lives about 40 minutes away so there's that but other than that we're having fun it's summer so it's all good all right i really hope that y'all enjoyed watching my weekly check-in even though it might be short i hope that y'all enjoyed and i will catch y'all in my next video bye bye now